So it was day three of my hot dog course today and we made um, some more shaken drinks. So we made a Cosmo and daiquiri, a caipirinha which is made with cachaça and I have pronounced that correctly. Um, and daiquiri, daiquiri, caipirinha, um, cosmopolitan, mito. Um, so, um, I think about three of those four are on our test for Friday potentially, so I might be having to make them later in the week. Um, and what I'm really struggling with is remember which, remember, remembering which drinks have to be shaken versus spilt versus stirred, when I should muddle, when I should churn. Um, basically mint does not, should not be muddled. Um, lime and sugar can be muddled together. Um, but there's so much to remember. And then we were tasting rums and whiskies this afternoon. So we were looking at Scotch versus Irish whiskey, when there's an E, when there is not an E, pot stills versus column stills, rum, where that comes from. So it's spiritual home is the Caribbean. Um, so there was lots to take in today as well. Um, but I'm really, really enjoying it still. And um, I just have so much to remember before I test on Friday. So um, I'm going to do some more revision this evening and then get in at night. But I have drunk every single cocktail I've made the day. And that was probably a bad idea. But it may have helped me learn more about the cocktails. I don't know. But I have been very happy with every cocktail I've made today. The only one that I've made so far that I wasn't happy with was my... Um, whiskey sours because I didn't think it was frothy, frothy enough. I didn't have a big, big enough window on it. But all the drinks today, I've been really happy with the balance. I've been really happy with the window um, and their um, appearance. And so, if I get any of them on Friday, it's just a matter of remembering the measures that need to go in them. So, for a Cosmopolitan, for example, you have 20, 20, 40, so that's 20, 20, 40, 10, sorry. So that's 20 triple sec, 40 vodka, <laughs> 20 cranberry, and 10 lime. For a caipirinha, it was, I'm really testing myself here. 50 cachaça, 25 lime, 15 sugar syrup. For a mojito, it was four wedges of lime, six to 10 mint leaves, depending on the size, 50 milliliters of rum, and crushed ice, and churning and muddling, garnished with mint. For a caipirinha, oh my goodness, it was 50 milliliters of cachaça, 25 of lime, 15 of sugar syrup. For a daiquiri, it was rum light, 50 milliliters. 25 of lime, 15 of sugar syrup. Oh man. And which was the. No, mojitos have actual sugar in. One of the drinks have actual sugar in. I think it's the mojito. It's definitely the mojito because of the spoon. I have so much to learn, um, but it's going really well. I should drink less. Wish me luck.